Hello everyone, today I will quickly explain to you how to play Roller Champions like a champ. First things first, the rules. In a nutshell, your objective is to score 5 points. To do so, you must carry the ball with your team for an entire lap through 4 checkpoints while avoiding the enemy team. Then you can throw the ball into the ring, basically the goal, and score. If you complete multiple laps, you can score more points in one shot. Now, the most important part, movement. To move your character, use like always double VASD keys on keyboard or the left joystick on your controller. To move even faster, you can pump or basically crouch when you descend the slope by pressing shift on keyboard or right trigger. You can also jump with space or button A and X depending on which controller you use. This way you can go higher on the walls to gain even more speed when pumping or crouching. Finally, to break or slow down or quickly turn around, you can use Q on PC or the right bumper. If you keep holding it, you can walk, which can be very useful to position yourself right. Now that you've understood how to move in this game, let's see how to finally have control of the ball. You simply ride next to it. It will only work if it's loose. If it's not, you must take it from the enemy player. To do so, you can tackle. The button is right click on PC, R button X on Xbox and square on PlayStation. There are multiple ways to tackle. The most basic one is pressing it once. You can also double tap it to throw yourself on the enemy. You'll be able to hit him from further away, but you will also fall. If you tackle and jump just afterwards, you can perform an uppercut, which is also useful to jump higher or catch the ball before it enters the goal. Then, for more advanced moves, you can also use tackles in the air. After jumping, you can press tackle once and you will simply tackle in the air, and by pressing it twice, you will throw yourself to the ground to tackle opponents and dive faster. After you have the ball in your hands, What's next? You must use the pumping technique and jumping against the wall for higher speeds you can take the checkpoints as fast as possible and don't get caught. You can also use your teammates to go faster by holding on to them. To do that you must hold the F key or the left bumper. Then you can pump together for extra speed. If you release the holding button and move forward, you can use them as a boost. Or you can press jump to jump much higher and eventually score. Sharing the ball is key to victory. If you are in a bad position and surrounded by opponents, pass the ball to an ally by pressing E on PC, Y or triangle on the controller. If they are further away, you can aim and shoot the ball by pressing left click with the mouse or left trigger on controller. There are two ways of throwing a ball. You can aim in the air to make a parabolic shot, which is nice to make a pass to a teammate which is far away and there are enemies between you and him. Or you can aim to the ground to make a more like bowling shot, which is often easier to catch for your teammate but also less secure. With this tutorial, you should finally be able to play the game as if you always did. Let us know if you want more of this in the comments. And don't hesitate to subscribe for more advanced tips coming soon.